every day the action and the excitement was going on a different peak and a different level. So on day one when you do an evening safari, at that point you won't get too much encounters. But the sundowner was a memorable experience. The next day when you went for the Mara, we had a thought process in our mind that to find an animal in Mara will be very easy. But it's not that easy. You need to spot a little do effort because of the size. But when you start getting encounters, it's back to back. So we got so lucky, we saw a live kill also over there. And then we got very lucky where there were four lions eating a, their kill. Beauty part of it is the vultures were sitting on the left hand side. So the lion was taking a move and then they again turned back and the vultures start going flying back. So these all when you get so close to the nature and I, the best thing of what I like is the bonding and what the relationship you get so connected. Most important thing what I felt over there doing this experience, it's a first lifetime experience. And when you were getting the business calls also at this point of time, you thought not to take those calls. You get so engrossed in the nature. It's a lifetime experience. No one can forget these things throughout the life. You travel anywhere in the world, UK, Paris, Europe, they are more into shopping oriented destination cathedrals. This is what leaves a picture in your mind. Adventure, I would call Africa, especially Kenya, Mara and Nakaru, the big daddy of wildlife.